Okay, excuse me. The great torch shines with the pure light of mania. You chose well. In accordance with the ancient tradition, receive now the raiment of Arden Su in honor of your mighty deed in service to mania. Thank you. I needed to look for new clothes. I didn't like the one I have. I think something along the lines you you were wearing would please me. I'm thinking about replacing the Duke. Yes. How we would all aspire to be as great a leader as the first. Our savior, Arden Sul. The greatest Duke of the ages. We celebrate him with the ritual of accession. The path to maniac bliss. Mm -hmm. Now tell me about this ritual. An important part of our history, my friend. I would be glad to tell the tale if you have a moment. Uh, yes, please, describe the ritual's history. Arden Sul was perhaps the greatest duke to walk our land. Many years ago, he decided to hold a night of absolute indulgence, resplendent with dance, wine, and sex, to celebrate his fondness for his brethren. Hmm. The green moat flowed like water in a stream, as the revelers voraciously succumb to its rapturous waves. Well, this hardly sounds lethal. Ah, but it was. As the bacchanal reached a crescendo, the people began to clutch their chests as their very hearts exploded. <laughs> the green moat had taken its toll. The ground stained a deep crimson as the sanguine liquid flowed from their lifeless bodies. To represent that night, when the ruler of mania is to be replaced, he partakes of the green moat and allows his lifeblood to flow upon the altar. Mm-hmm. Well, then tell me what to do. Certainly. When the ruler of mania has decided it is time, he will choose a successor from his court. The successor is invited to a huge celebration, a night of hedonistic revelry, mm -hmm. wine, song, and of course, green moat. Okay. During this, the exiting regent imbibes three doses of the potent drug. This causes his heart to burst, and his lifeblood flows from his body. The successor then gathers the drug-tainted blood and brings it to the altar of Arden Sul in the Sacellum. Once this is done, I will proclaim the successor a duke or duchess. Then, Shea Gorath gives his blessing, and the cycle is completed. Mm -hmm. All right. Uh, I didn't know that this is this is read as Sacellum. I. Uh, I I've read that as seculum, as the as the Latin word for something saint, or uh, what's another English word? S secular. It's it's in that word. But okay, I've spoken to Devenin, high priest of Mania. The ritual of ascension, accession for Mania, requires the current ruler to commit suicide by taking three doses of the green mode. Which is lethal. Then his drug tainted blood must be brought to the altar of Arden Sul at the Sacellum. I should now speak to Arctus to learn of the Mencia's ritual. Another sheep returns to the flock. Mm -hmm. I'm disappointed in your choice. You'll find Mania to be a fickle friend. Possibly. I don't like the the graphic effects in his face. Look how how messed up it is. I think that that's to do with my new graphic settings and, and probably the graphics card itself will drive us for it. Anyway, tell me your part about the ritual of accession. Seldom is the subject ever... Br Wait a moment. Did you want to hear the history of the ritual? Yes, why not? Explain me the ritual's history. I'd like to hear your memories of it. As it happened so many years ago, 
My lord Arden Sewell suspected a traitor in his midst. Mm -hmm. Not wishing to find himself on the wrong end of a blade, he gathered his flock here in the Sacellum. By poisoning the sacramental wine, Arden Sewell was able to suppress any such conspiracy in one fell swoop. Huh? So he can kill them all? Yes. He then removed their hearts from their bodies and used his ancient scrying technique, known as Viseromancy, to read their lifeblood. When Arden Sewell couldn't divine the traitor's true nature in their hearts, he became distraught and took his own life in the same way. Hmm. From that day on, the ritual of accession for the throne of dementia was set. Okay, and what is it for me to do? Very well. Spoken like a true son of the demented. <laughs> to become the ruler of dementia, the current leader's heart must be cut out and brought to the altar of Arden Sewell in the Sacellum. Once this is done, I can pronounce the heart bearer a duke or duchess. Then, all that is required is the blessing of our lord, Sheogora. Mm-hmm. I've spoken to Arctus, High Priest of Dementia. The ritual of accession in Dementia is simple. Sil would have to be slain by the proposed successor and her heart brought to the altar of Arden Sul at the Sacellum. After I decide which ritual to undertake, I should return to Shiogorath and inform him of my choice. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well... I do, I more believe the story of this, this Arctos, the Dervenin, he has, well, uh, it's, shame, shame what? You know, it's easier for me to understand these non uh, uh, divine things or magical effects with blessings citizen with pure and simple practices like cutting somebody's heart out and sacrificing Speak, it citizen. rather than Drinking some some kind of um, well, well, as it was at the other ritual, but nevertheless, I I intend to replace the duke. I never liked him much. You just need to convince him that that I may be his successor. She works the other residents pretty hard. I hear they're not happy. Who's he? Goodbye. Yes? Hello. Yes? What? Greetings. Let's talk. What? No. Oh, thank goodness. The resonator of judgment has saved us. It might. Let's talk. What? What is it? Very busy. Things to do. Or see. Or something. Um... No. <laughs> well, tell me at least the newest rumors. A torch is lit. The light is lighted. Or lit. It's a great torch. Uh, much better than most. I guess... Goodbye. I'm, I'm not in... Greetings. I shouldn't talk with him. Usnar in Crucible is afraid of cats. Cats! That's ridiculous. I understand there's a... Welcome thing. to the House of Mania. Yeah, around. thanks. Let me read it up. The ritual of accession for mania requires the current ruler to commit suicide by taking 
three doses of green mode which is lethal all right um, so i guess we, we must now speak to shiogorath and tell him tell him Blessing about citizen. our decision to replace the duke of mania Hmm. Let's take the bliss way, uh, the, um, the crucible way. I think that is an easier way to the uh, Sasellum Arden Sul in crucible. At least I know it better. Blessings, citizen. So, greetings, Shogora. You're back! How nice for you! Does that mean you've made a decision? Or are you lost? Suicidal? Just let me know. <laughs> I'm not suicidal. I've made a decision. A friendly word of warning before you choose. Once you've decided which duke to replace, there's no turning back. One choice. No more, no less. Try not to do something stupid. Um. So which is it? What will it be? Mania? Dementia? The suspense is killing me! Or you, if I have to keep waiting. <laughs> oh, I'll replace Thaden, the Duke of Mania. A safer choice, perhaps. Maybe you'll live through this. Aiden's a bit lost these days. Yes, I Not think Not that it's so. a bad thing. It suits him. <laughs> Until now. Besides, won't it be a grand surprise when you make his heart burst from too much green moat? Aiden loves surprises. I think I could serve him some green moat. Just give me it. Ritual mania. Did I get some green moat? Well, how do I... How do I do it with Thaden? Thaden may be in a constant state of euphoria, but I wouldn't underestimate his intelligence. <laughs> this is so much fun! All right. We will speak. When I'll figure out myself. We don't have any green mode, do we? Hmm, but it's... Yes, I, of course, I, I must ask about Thaden's court because he must select me as the successor and learn the best way to get him over those on green mode without his knowledge. Yes, yes, that's it, that's it. That's our, that's our task for the next time, for the next session. Until then... We'll make a pause and save this game. It's been fun playing. I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.